Yo, what's up YouTube? It's your host with the most prevail here, bringing you guys another video. Now for this video, it's going to be a on X Defiant, of course. That's all we do now, in case you guys didn't know. Um, if you guys do want more X Defiant videos just like this one, especially, you know, uh, create a class setup videos. If you guys like S&D, that's where I'm going to be at a lot, bringing you guys S&D loadouts, you know, search and destroy. Just, you know, game mode Pacific loadouts for that game mode. But, you know, most importantly, leave a comment down below. What do you guys think about this game? Are you hyped to play it? Are you able to... Uh, play it tomorrow on UM. Are you on PC? Uh, unfortunately, if you're not on PC, you guys gotta wait till the game drops, which we still don't know yet. There is a potential leak that I came across not too long ago, but I don't think it's true. I think Mark Rubin would have already talked about it since it's very, very soon, the leak. I'm gonna read the article that he gave us today on this public session. You guys uh, think I'm read too slow or stumble too much. I get it. I'm not the best reader. Just pause the video and come back if you guys want. But here it is. September 26, 2023 is when he made this. Uh, what is a public test session? Public test sessions are X Defiance takes on public test servers. Since we are live, these sessions will serve as our platform to work new features, features, sorry, and configuration throughout the year to get a valuable feedback before rolling them out to the following season. Public test sessions build our pre patch launcher inside sessions philosophy of involving our community in the development process okay as we are getting close to the launch we are ready to test our out this system join us as we open our servers for our public test session trial run um so this isn't really a beta i want to get that across it's it's a test server session whatever it is different um these are going to be in the game itself once the game's even launched so like they bring us a new update and they let us test out the updates before it officially releases into the game in case it's game breaking it's something X, uh, I think Call of Duty should do a bit more. You know, test their shit before they put it in the damn game. Yeah, I, you know, you really don't need to read this here. Uh, preload, you can preload it today. So make sure you guys do that right now. It's a 30 gigabyte update. Do that depending on how fast your internet speed is. You might want to do it as soon as possible. It's going to take you a bit, but uh let's see content preseason content maps modes and weapons attachments will be unlocked okay that's cool i didn't really think about that i didn't even read this part I, that the, all the attachments are going to be unlocked for us so we don't have to level up we just you know go right in and start playing it'll be nice since you know we only have it for six hours we don't have time to level up and unlock things test sessions will be available to play on pc and have no nda the PTS will be a great opportunity for additional feedback ahead of launch to help us continue making the best experience possible. See you then. I truly love their communication. I've never seen another game developer do it as much as, you know, Mark Rubin does. It's something that, you know, their competitors should take note of, in my opinion. <laughs> yeah, sad news for console players. You guys can't play this tomorrow, but PC players, I know you guys are hyped. I mean, console players are hyped too. Make sure you guys download it. Uh, for this potential leak I found, I'll throw a picture up on here, up on the screen of it. And it was leaked over on Ubisoft Connect. Now, this is just a screenshot. It says October 1st. I don't believe that. So I don't really think this is true. I think Mark Rubin would have already commented about it, considering it's what, three days from now, something like that. I just think he would have already mentioned it, but and that's just because he's been very open about everything that's gonna happen. Only given us three days ahead of time, I don't think he would do that. But maybe, you know, it would be f really fucking cool if it launched October 1st. Like the screenshot that somebody took said, I'm not, I'm not going to say this is when it's dropping. I honestly don't believe it, but there's a chance. So, but if you guys do find this video helpful, and you guys want way more exifying videos, definitely, like I said, hit that sub button. And most importantly, comment down below. What do you guys think? Um, you guys hype for this? You think you're not going to play it? What's up with your thoughts? Uh, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. It's your host with the most prevail here signing out.